Mark Lucas for NStuffMusic.com. Today, we have quite an interesting amalgamation of a guitar. And uh, the name of the company is called K-Line Guitars. They are built in St. Louis, Missouri by a gentleman named Chris Kronline. This particular model is called the San Bernardino. And um, it pretty much echoes the body shape of a, uh, a jazz master type of guitar, but with some interesting twists to it. Uh, for one, it's got P90 pickups that are wired to a three-way switch, and these are uh, built by the esteemed pickup builder Jason Lawler. Really great sounding pickups. We have a Tone Pros Bridge, a tailpiece also, 21 fret rosewood board with a 10 inch radius. We have a real nice sort of 50s type shape on the back of the neck. Uh, substantial is the way I would describe it, uh, but not uncomfortable. Vintage tuning gears, four bolt neck plate. The body is made of alder and it's two piece center joined alder finished in sonic blue with a tortoiseshell pickguard. Um, what Chris did with this guitar, as far as the relicking process goes, is that it's what I would consider to be called a closet classic. In other words, it's, it's relicked a little bit, but it's not really beat up or even halfway relicked. It's sort of like a guitar that was just used a little bit and then put back in its case. But, um, a very balanced instrument, um, really wonderful sounding guitar. And let me tune my uh, D string up here for a second, and then I'll go through some more uh, more features with you. So, on to the pickups. What you heard at the beginning of the video were both of the pickups. When both pickups are engaged, they are hum canceling. Here's our neck pickup. <laughs> Then both of them again. Then we'll go to our back pickup. Something I found with these with this guitar also is that with the tone control taken down to about halfway, the character of each pickup dramatically changes. So here's our bridge pickup all the way out, you know. Um, and then if we take this down about halfway. The same thing in the neck. Here's all the way out. And then halfway down, all the way down if you really want a um, quasi sort of jazz sound. And then up a little bit. then all the way out. And these pickups are really, really wonderful sounding P90 pickups. Uh, Jason Lawler is really um, quite a brilliant guy when it comes to uh, designing pickups, as I'm sure lots of people know. Now we're going to go over to our overdrive section. Today we're using a TC Electronic flashback delay and an Ibanez Tube Screamer. So, this is both pickups overdriven.
it's an interesting thing in general about p90 pickups that even when they do get pushed pretty hard that they still retain a lot of clarity um so you can hear all the note definition and everything so here's our bridge pickup overdriven <laughs> And last but not least, the neck pickup overdriven. Once again, that really, really nice note separation and definition, even though overdriven. So, this is available at endstuffmusic.com. A handmade guitar by the luthier Chris Kronlein, under the name of K-Line Guitars. This is the San Bernardino model. A really wonderful instrument that really ticks all the right vibes as far as like a vintage type of vibe, but with modern uh, sensibilities and player features. So... Um, Nonetheless, my name is Mark Lucas. Please come and see us. Thanks for coming to uh, watch our videos as always, and um, we appreciate your business and your comments. Thank you. <laughs>